Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company in the commentary box today is, of course, Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from the Pro League. How's it going to go, Stuart? Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. at the starting lineup for Al Hilal. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And the match begins. Now they're on the scent of something positive. Can he put it away? Oh, that goes down as a wonderful save. But hang on, offside is the decision here. Hang on to the ball. Succeeded in keeping it in play. A move of promise on the flank. Marega. Attending to his defensive chores. Gomis. Can he put it away? My goodness, the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper. Great effort to keep that one in play. Oh, a lovely ball. Clean challenge. Salem Aldosari. Gustavo Cuellar. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Is it going to end up being productive for them? There's a slide rule pass. Chance maybe. Oh, great header. Smart stop though. Big chance. Well, there is the opening goal. The pressure finally telling. And they get their due reward. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Marega and Pereira here. Excellent passing. Chance to do damage. Will he play it in? Could be threatening. 
Bafa Timbi Gomes. And another one. Two quick goals. Will it turn out to be the two punch knockout? Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do justice to how patient they were in the build-up. Just so composed, waiting for the right moment. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. Well, a second goal for them here. Sami and unable to keep possession as the stats show us the visitors have had most of the play and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly their pressing has been excellent and they just haven't stopped working it's been a fantastic performance up to now and well, that's a super ball over the top and it went sailing over the crossbar not a moment he'll want to remember Sami, Raihi, Afri Aqua. Now let's see what they can do here. Real chance. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. Now sending it in. Well, he almost headed it in. Well, half-time coming up, and this is not exactly what the home fans came to see. Stuart, your thoughts on what we've seen? Well, they can certainly play better than this. They've been too slow in possession and not aggressive enough with their closing down. Those two things have to change in the second half. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, as you can see, he gets there first, he makes good contact with the ball and finds the back of the net. That's a decent header. This is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board and couldn't keep himself... Salem Al Dosseri. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. And we're focusing on him for us and Stewart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What a good performance. And he's not finished just yet.
The second half commences. It was such a one-sided first half. Might it be different this time round? Marega. Al Buraik. Musa Marega has it. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Mateusz Pereira. Mohamed Al Buraik. Gomis now. Well, they'll be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Gomis. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Mohamed Raihi. Renato Chavez. And intercepts again. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. And a substitution in the offing. Aqua Raihi and a strong tackle chance to run at them and the cross is very much on well, since they have the ball the referee playing advantage here and he's retrospectively awarded the free kick now having tried to give them the advantage well, the referee won't be quite as lenient next time. Got to tread more carefully. And they will make the change now. And a useful cross. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. A good and fair challenge. He has time to play it over. Good looking sequence. Andre Carillo. Al Buraik. And deliver towards the back post. The clearance wasn't decisive. Chance to finish. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. And time for the change now. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Well, showing good defensive judgment. Al Buraik. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Vieto. Has a go, and the keeper getting across to stop it.
Let's see about the delivery. Well, they can keep possession now. Well, approaching full time, and this is wearing the look of Mission Impossible for the home side, Stuart. Well, where do I start? They've been totally outplayed in all areas of the pitch, but it's their defending that's really been poor today. No structure, too open, not enough desire, and a lack of urgency. This is a worrying performance. Andre Carillo. Will take it away. He won the ball. Fabio Abreu. Well, it could be on for him here. A wonderful intervention. Foiling them effectively. Bafetimbi Gomis. And a throw in forthcoming. Mauricio. Being pressed and pressed high. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. It was the nature of the performance more than anything else. They never got out of second gear and were completely dominated all over the park. Tell you what, though, I won't want to be in that dressing room right now. Well, Stewart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.